Hello, my name is Mary Barrent. I am only one of the many people who bring together the Tri Valley chapter of the PNMD, which meets in Pleasanton. Here's a little history about the group. In the late 1990s, PNMD asked their members who lived in the Tri Valley if they were interested in starting a chapter closer to home. Dottie Baird and her husband, who had Parkinson's, stepped up to start the local group. They contacted the senior center who offered them space to meet. They had a small group of consistent participants, which has now grown to be about 45 to 60 people per meeting. We have attendees from various parts of the East Bay, predominantly San Ramon, Livermore, Dublin, and Pleasanton. We meet on the second Saturday of the month. Our monthly speakers are listed in the Shaky Times and on the PNMD website. We really want to get together again soon. We would hope to and love to have you join us. Since June's theme is all about resist, resilience, Joan asked that I talk about what I believe resilience is for me. There are many different ways to express resilience. Every individual is different. I believe that resilience is also the determination to treat life as one experiment after another. Research is all about pushing yourself to find out what works. As my husband Bill would say, to find your tipping point, you have to tip. We can't be afraid to make mistakes or try something new and different because that is how we learn, how we discover new ways to do something, to enter an exciting stage of our life, no matter what disabilities we have, and we all have them. As we all grow older, we need to let go of our past and look to the future to find out what we can do now. My husband, Bill, was diagnosed with Parkinson's 14 years ago, this coming July. And then almost four years ago was definitively diagnosed with a variation of PD called multiple systems atrophy Parkinson's. As a caregiver, what keeps me going is working with this group of fighters who, despite the difficult journey, still live their lives, work to stay healthy, and set their sights on today and tomorrow to find happiness. That, to me, is resilience. Thank you.